Oh, and another uh, similarity between this game and uh, our senior project game, which doesn't have a name. That's why I keep referring to it as our senior project game. Um, this right here, you're going to be able to upgrade your main weapon with different modules, and th the modules will have different effects. Um, we're not exactly sure. We haven't really worked out whether or not the effects are going to change the uh, behavior of the weapon. You know, if maybe a module will um, allow your weapon to fire through walls or fire through enemies or something. Maybe it'll bounce off of walls or something. Or we could just do some. We could just do modules that affect uh, the weapon's stats, like they add attack or they increase the fire rate or the range of the weapon. Or we could just do a mix of the two, and I think honestly that's probably the way we're gonna go. And at this, in this game right now, you can only equip two of these things. Uh, later on, I'll be able to equip three. Um, like I said, we haven't really worked. Uh, we haven't really worked this out too much in our game yet, so I'm not really sure how many you're going to be able to equip in our game, but yeah, it'll be something similar to this. So yeah, we have basically have a lot more life now, and we have a canteen that has six energy, so if we're running low on energy, we'll be able to replenish six right there. And now we're broke. 490 zenny. I'm totally glad that I kept kicking those cans. I'm just going to do this one more time just so I'm not completely broke. Uh, that, went, that went a little too far. Uh, that was okay. Oh, that was perfect. Hell yeah. 1,000 zenny. Okay, so for this part, um... Well, I'll just show you what happens if you just run up to him. Hey, we're having a secret meeting. Get out of here. If I'm careful, I should be able to get close without them noticing. You can move slowly by pressing the circle button and the directional button at the same time. So yeah, that's what you use to sneak. But honestly, as far as I can remember, this is the only part in the game where you have to do this. Like that guy right there can't see you. That girl looks suspicious, I tell you. Whisper, whisper, she has to be a pirate. She said she was looking for treasure. No one believes us. We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to get her ourselves. Hey, s someone's spying on us. <coughs> it's that blue guy again. Let's kick his ass. Come on, everybody, let's go. I got mines, dude. Stay away from me. Okay, so now we're here. Uh, oh, right, right. Okay, right. got it? Once the decision's made, there's no turning back. Nothing less than 100%. And remember, it's more than just guns and ships. It's whoever has the most information that wins, right? Great, we understand. You need to keep your costs and risks as low as possible and stay on schedule. <laughs> Very organized pirates. That's right. You've got it. Huh? What are you looking at? Huh. What a bitch. Okay, so now we can find some more items. And as you can see, the lid did not fly off, meaning there's something in here. Yeah, there is. Money. Ten zenny, really. Really, game. Okay, I could get lost uh, searching every little... It's very easy to get turned around if you're looking for all these garbage pails, but... I'll do my best. Broken motor. Okay, we've been here, so this whole area is done. What's going on in 
this little alley here. Nothing. Okay, this is all done. This, you can, uh, I think it's like 10 zenny you put in here, and it refills all your life. Let me see how much it is. The vending machine. Oh, it's 100 zenny. So yeah, you basically, you could pay 100 zenny to refill your life. Or you could kick it and get uh, a soda for free. But you appear on the news later saying that, like, blue guy is stealing soda, blah, blah, blah. Garbage pail, anything inside? No, there is not anything inside. It's also empty. I think there's something in here. Damn you, trash can. So this whole area is done, I think. I think I checked this one. Yeah, I did. Okay, so this, so we're done checking for uh, free stuff. I forget exactly where I'm supposed to go now. Oh, you can actually jump on these cars to <laughs> some of these cars, I guess. I guess it doesn't work for all of them. Like this truck right here, we can jump on that. Oh, it does work if they're stopped. We can ride around. I think I'm going north. Yeah, yeah, I'm going north. I gotta go north. Turn. Really? Screw you, though. Okay, so let's go north. Ah. Actually, you know what? We can go in this sewer here. Get some more stuff. I'm gonna have to explore all this stuff. This looks really strange. I guess it's like sewage or something, but it just looks really weird. Looks kind of cool, but I mean, it's like radioactive or something. <laughs> oh, I guess this is it. Oh, wait. I didn't know I would be able to... Okay, we've been here before. Escape! That was basically uh, the first ruin where we found that guy in. So we don't need to go back there. I'm just gonna go north, which is this way. Oh, here we go. Okay, we're going the right way. Huh? What do you want? been following me around all day haven't you sorry but I don't have but I don't have time to play with you just stay out of my way play with me fuck it how old are these kids honestly mega man looks like i don't know maybe like 16 15 years old i guess they are just kids i don't know oh this is where i'm going okay city hall Sorry, no unauthorized entry allowed. Do you have business here? Yeah, I do. Let me in. Mr. Barrel, yes, he's in there. He's in a meeting with the mayor. Please wait one minute. Okay, so you're not going to let me in unless I talk to you. Thank you for waiting. Go on in. in school. <laughs> it's a small world, isn't it? To tell you the yeah, truth, it is. we've gotten reports that there are some pirates headed this way. I was asking the professor if he might have any idea what they're after. I'll bet anything they're after the legendary treasure supposedly buried on this island. How the heck does he there know that? There are a lot of stories about the treasure. 
but no one knows exactly what it is. I thought maybe you might know something about it, Professor. I've been in the digging business a long time, oh, but I, I haven't that's how. been able to find out anything about this island's treasure except legends and myths. Look, Mega Man, I'll be here for a while talking with Amelia. So why don't you go back and keep an eye on Roll? Tell her not to worry about me, okay? I know this is being like way too um, anal, but like in the beginning of the game when we first landed on this island, the professor was like, what did you call this island, Mega Man? Kato Locks? Like he didn't know anything about the island. And now he knows about some kind of treasure. I guess maybe she, he learned it from her. I, I don't know. But it's just a little inconsistent. And I am writing our game's story, so I have to care about stuff like that. That dog is like way too close to her. We could talk to these guys, but I don't want to. I'm probably just gonna say, oh, she's a pirate, she's a pirate. Yeah, we know. We gotta go back south. First, we gotta go here. Talk to. Actually, I think it's her. Hey, cut it out! Don't you know you can't treat girls that way? <coughs> hey, hold on. Down, boy. Down. Boy? His name is Paprika. He's not a very manly dog. Mega Man, you jerk. I think this is the right way. Yes, it is. I have a little bit more money now, so I will buy some stuff. Can't afford anything. Lame. I might as well buy this. Why not? And just because I like having everything in a game, I'm gonna buy useless crap too. Oh, by the way, um, if your shield does break, again, you do take more damage, but the way you tell if your shield is broken is that you see that little, um, in my life gauge, little area behind my life, it's black. Uh, if my shield were broken, it would be red. So yeah, if your shield's broken, be very careful. Come on. Get in there. Winning! That's too bad. What the... What's too bad? 